that that photo. I think we can go as well. Well, you have to go to the little one. We're going to make the person go. It's a good one. Yeah, I don't remember a long time ago. But let's do it at Texas. Yeah. And you know the basic training? Mm -hmm. Like when you drop this. Yeah. And also they're going to talk to you how to type. I think so. I don't know. Uh, In the computer? Last year they taught us. Yeah. So, hi everyone, I'm gonna do the thing. Right, I'm in the laundry room. I'm gonna balance the phone with the dryers and talk into it. So, I have a friend here. I've had a friend here. And she actually seemed really cool, but then today she was sitting with her roommates who are friends with the exes of the dude I'm seeing and she blew me off. She said I'll talk to you later. Then I went into the weight room, you know, and I was on the exercise bike. Where am I? So, I'm in the weight room. I wave her over. She ignores me. Right? I'm pretty sure it's just because of her roommates and they're kind of judgmental, nasty harpies. So, they actually told me, I don't know, she actually told me, don't ask Michael to prom, they will kill you, and then they'll kill me for not telling them first, and I'm like, it's really not any of their business? You know, but she still cares, cares way too much about what they think. And she's kind of judgmental too, like there was this girl at lunch who had on a white shirt, and she's like, Oh my god, her shirt's sheathed there. She's wearing a red lacy bra. And I'm like, so? And she's like, I don't want to see that. And I'm like, then don't look. Like, she was literally sitting behind her. She could have easily just turned around and not looked. Anyway. So I don't appreciate being blown off. And so I think I'm just going to not really talk to her for a little bit. Anyway, so because I have nothing better to do, I'm seeing this guy, and originally it was going to be, I'll admit it, it's going to be out of spite. Um, it's going to be out of revenge, now it's out of spite. <laughs> um, because they're like, oh my god, don't go out with him, he's a disgusting pig. And I'm like, really? How much of a disgusting pig? And anyway, from what they're saying, it's not actually that bad. It's just a little annoying, that's all. And they're like, they're like, oh, I went out with him for two weeks. And I'm like, okay. Anyway, they have this Club the Exes here. That kind of tells you a little bit about how much everyone is in everyone else's business. So they have the Club of the Exes, and I'm just not impressed by any of them, any of this, and I think, wow, it's not, it's not their business who their ex is seeing, even if we all do live on campus together. And anyway, as I said, I'm doing this plan <laughs> because I'm waiting for someone who is, um, not exactly knocking down my door at the moment and he's got my heart so there's no way that I could love this person but you know why not try to have a little fun <laughs> so, yeah. and meanwhile Mick is ignoring me I guess she wants to talk to me later when her roommates aren't around. She's like, I don't know, she complains a little bit about them because she says, well, they don't like the fact that I'm obsessed with Loki. And I'm like, who cares if you're obsessed with Loki? That's your interest, you know, and you should be entitled to your interest. And she's like, well, I have to live with them. And I'm like, so what? They have to live with you. They can deal with it. You know, they're really rude, actually. They accused me of being rude because... One of their friends was butting in on my conversation with Mika. I shut him down. And 
They're like, wow, has anyone told you you're extremely rude? And I'm like, excuse me? I could make a tasteless comment about her, but I will choose not to. Um, because she's extremely something too, but it's a little bit more obvious in her case. <laughs> Note to self, book more time in the weight room. Do not want to do that. Oops, did I say something? Anyway, I spent like 40 minutes in the weight room. Awesome. And um, let's see. That one has stuff in it, and let's check this one. Whoops! Fail. That one was already on the other side. Yeah, that one's fail. Yeah. Should I be the Grim Reaper and just take all that shit off? Okay. Yes, you do it. You see me. Do it, do I it. I did the right thing. Just don't throw it on the floor. Right? I did the right thing like I should. Yeah. Me, I was in a laundry room one time and someone uh, actually... You're, you're Dawn, right? Yes. Alina. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Officially. Someone actually dogged me all the way to the... To the wash machine um, at my complex at home. Oh, okay. I took out their clothes and threw them on the ground and then put my clothes in. Oh, not odd. Yeah. Oh, okay. uh, here's a sock. Thank you. Yep. Um, dude, okay, I've had the most fucked up shit happening. Like, out of laundry mat. Like that, like how you're talking about? Uh-huh. Okay. There was this elderly couple, right? Mm-hmm. And they think, you know, how cute, an old couple, right? <laughs> like, you know, how nice. Yeah, these fucking con artists, they're, um, they're I over there. Are. Oh, shine one. Uh, that one's mine. Yeah, yeah that one's mine. Cool. Um, the yeah. other one might not be. <laughs> the other one's not Well, me. actually, this one, Vicky, is going to be done right now. Like, I'm just taking my stuff out. I know, Vicky is just dry. Oh, yeah, you're kind of screwed, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mine are going to need to dry, too, eventually. Yeah. Okay, so these old, this old couple, right? Uh-huh. They're the cutest fucking thing ever, like the couple from Up. Uh-huh. Okay. So, I'm over there, you know, minding my own business, throwing some bounty and my stuff, whatever. Mm -hmm. And I see the old man pull out his bag, and the old lady gets her bag, and they start jacking the fucking things. I was like, what? Like, taking the coins out. Oh, I was like, what the fuck? Not even. And so then they asked me, oh, how much longer do your clothes have? I'm like, oh, I just put them in for about an hour and a half. And they're like, oh, okay. Well, then we won't touch it. Because the moment we touch it, it'll stop your clothes. Because it has nothing, you know, in it. I was like, oh, my God. Well, at least they were somewhat decent they to were, you. They were cool, but I was like, this shit is not really happening. Like, somebody's pranking me. Like, this has to be some punk shit. Right. Like, an old couple? Well, that's why no one would suspect them. Except, but okay. You can't tell me that's not crazy. Um, right back. I don't know, I just thought it was nuts. Oh, like, oh my God. It's interesting. It I'll give you that. that. I've that never made, heard of that. That made my night. Yes. Wow. So I was in the living room just like this. And I'm basically, like, all the time coming in staring at me because I was in the exercise bike like right right in front of the door facing the door coming in so I was just staring at me and I <laughs> texted people I texted the guy I'm seeing who says the guys are being idiots and that they don't need to be looking and I'm like I can't blame them since it's still riding up past me by. And he's like, yeah, but they don't need to be drolling. Yes, you're up drolling instead of drolling and texting. And I said, oh, are you jealous? And he's like, maybe. And I'm like, well, it's too bad you can't come down here and like be my guard dog or whatever. And he's like, oh, you're teasing. And I'm like, yeah, he's gonna do laundry, you know. So I thought he was responding to the laundry thing, so I yeah, answered that before he sent his reply. So, share about that. 
down to doing anything. It takes it's funny. Funny's like people who stand, they're jealous. And I'm like, yes, guys are jealous because they can't wear flapper dresses from Hot Topic. And she responded, I didn't get it. <laughs> Honestly, I find this whole thing hilarious. Anyway, there are other people in here now. That's why my mouth is so close to the DS. to hear the thing. I don't want them to see the thing. This is so awkward. Seriously. I wish I could turn this off until my clothes are done. Just like secure so breed.